Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I want to show you guys a uniquely free VPN service called ProtonVPN. So if you've ever heard of Proton Mail, Proton VPN is actually made by the same guys. So in addition to having a mail service, they decided to create a VPN as well. So what's particularly unique about Proton VPN, if we go ahead and scroll down here a bit, is that on the free version, they do not hit you with ads, and they say that they also don't throttle your bandwidth or sell your data to third parties. And on top of that, you have unlimited bandwidth with Proton VPN. Which with this combination of features, you wouldn't really get anywhere else for free. Generally speaking, a VPN either has to have ads or kind of shadily sell your data to third parties. So you can see here that I'm actually running on the free trial of the pro version. They give you a seven day free upgrade uh, for you to try the pro features, obviously encouraging you to switch over and upgrade to that. So if you want to find the free download link for Proton VPN, I'm going to include the link to their website, protonvpn.net, on the description. So go ahead and click that, and when you get to the web page, you're going to want to scroll down until you get to the section that talks about free VPN. So internet security for everybody. Right below that is one called free VPN, and you'll see here the free version download. So I'll go ahead and click that here, and that'll take you to the page where you can hit get Proton VPN free. So if we go ahead and click that, it'll bring us to the sign up page. And we can go ahead and select free from the plan here. Enter an email to create an account and then choose get Proton VPN free down here at the bottom. And you'll be able to download it and log in with your account. And then when you download and install the program, you'll have this kind of interface. It's kind of got that techie feel to it. Let's show off a couple more features here. So if we go into the hamburger menu and settings, You'll see that you can have it start with your computer, of course, and you can have it start minimized under connection. You can have it automatically connect to the server you want. So by default, that would be fastest. But if you set up custom profiles, I believe you can choose that from over here. And under the advanced tab, uh, you can have a VPN kill switch, which will make sure that all the traffic on your computer goes through a VPN first and that the Proton VPN program will basically block all traffic that is not going through the VPN. You can also enable DNS leak protection, which I believe is there by default. So the idea of this is that it prevents people from doing a DNS query to get more information about your computer. And split tunneling, if you do want to let specific programs through Proton VPN so that they access the internet without being behind that VPN, then you can enable split tunneling and add specific programs to be excluded from the VPN. But of course you have to disconnect before you can do that. Okay, so one more thing people are probably wondering about is how are the speeds of Proton VPN? So earlier when we saw on the front page, they say that they don't throttle the speeds even if you are a free user. So obviously right now I am on the free trial of the pro version. Um, but let's go ahead and run the speed test. When I did this the other day, I got full download and upload speeds. So my internet connection right now is uh, 36 megabits per second upload and 36 megabits per second download. So if it's anything like yesterday, then it should be able to get pretty close to that. So it looks like this time I'm getting 23 megabits per second, which isn't bad. Uh, I am on a different server today, so uh, that's something to consider. Okay, um, so that's the speed with the US server. So let's do another test. This time I'm connected to the Japan free server and we'll see how this goes. So I uh, probably need to refresh the page. So I'll go to speedtest.net one more time and let's go ahead and run this test. So this time I got 14 megabits per second as the download speed for Japan number three, uh, Japan free number three, and 1.54 megabits per second as the upload speed. So the upload there is pretty slow. Since we can just go ahead and select the free servers, I think it makes sense to do another one here. Okay, so now we're connected to US free server number one. Let's go ahead and run that test. Okay, 13.25 megabits per second download and 0 0.38 megabits per second upload. And let's do the third country, which is Netherlands. So Netherlands free number one. We can go ahead and test that over here. Okay, so this time the upload speed was better. We got 4.68 megabits per second, and the download was kind of slow at 4.87 megabits per second. So clearly the free servers aren't quite as fast as the paid servers. I want to do one more test here real quick, though. Okay, so this test is going to be with the Hong Kong servers. Uh, let's go ahead and run that. All right, so these were the speeds I was looking at before, where pretty much I was getting full download and full upload connected to the Hong Kong servers. Obviously, it depends on where you are in the world, how good the servers are going to treat you, and what kind of ping you'll be able to receive with them. 
So there you go, at the very least, their paid servers are pretty fast. Uh, I don't know how much higher it can go than this. So hopefully those five speed tests can give you kind of an idea of what you're looking at here. The free servers aren't too bad. I mean, if you're going above 10 megabits per second, that's usually enough for streaming video and that kind of thing, or downloading stuff, though it may be a little bit slower. But when it comes to Proton VPN, the fact that it gives you unlimited bandwidth is a huge deal. I've only ever seen one free VPN do that. And that's Turbo VPN, which is only on uh, Android and maybe iOS. But the problem with that VPN is every time you use it, you get hit with an ad. So it's not really free and that you have to pay by watching ads. So the fact that Proton VPN does this by giving you access to free servers, unlimited bandwidth, and you don't have to watch any ads. So those things in combination, as far as I know, you can't get anywhere else, especially with a Windows based client. So you have access to the VPN on Android, iOS, Windows, and I think you can set it up on Linux and Mac as well. So this is probably as good as you're going to get with a free VPN in all honesty. So if you're still interested and you want to download the program, I'm going to include the link in the description. So once again, just click on the link and then scroll down until you see the section on free VPN. It'll be under internet security for everybody. So if you get down there, just click on the free version link and you should be able to go ahead, sign up and download the app for your system. So yeah, once again, I've been Chris. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys in my future video content.